So here's a little game that you can play to help children to learn times table facts and see relationships between times table facts. Okay, so here's a little game for helping children to learn, you know, the, see the links between multiplication facts. I've written on a zero and a four there. There's, there's ten spaces and there's a thicker one in the middle. So what's this one? Forty. Forty, how do you know? It is ten times four. This one? That's twenty, half of forty. And what about that one? That one is seven times four, which is twenty-eight. Mm, eight more than twenty, yeah, good. And what about this one here? That one is 36. How do you know? Because it is 9 times 40, which is basically 40 take away 4. Okay, uh, this one. That is double 4, which is 8. Uh, let's go to this one. That one's 24. How do you work it out? Um, because it's 4 more than 20. Okay, uh, this one here? Um, that one is 8 times 4, which is... oh. 32. Well done. And, and let's go for this one. That one is 16. 16. 4 less than 20. And finally? 12. Well done. So you can adapt this game in lots of different ways. You could use decimals, but here we go, using multiples of 10. So I've written down this time 0 and 30. Um, so this one, 10 lots? 300. And again, let's go for this one. Um, that one is 150. Are you sure? Yes. How do you know? Because it is half of 300 and in three years it is 15 and then it's just 10 times bigger. Okay, and this one? Um, that is 270. And let's go for how many lots of 30? Um, six lots of 30. Six lots of 30 is... Six lots of 30 is 180. And so on. I hope you can see how this activity can be really useful. So if you go to icmaths.com, the free resources tab, and then games and resources, underneath this video, you'll find a little clip of that number line and you can use that. Hope it's really useful, a really easy, adaptable game that parents or teachers can play with children.